So today we ask, is class-based discrimination the new apartheid in South Africa? We find ourselves in South Africa in a very, very disturbing situation where the gap between the poor and the rich is widening, but also not that, and that the state is not uh, taking any measures to um, cap these widening of gaps. But instead, the state is also playing a, a major role uh, in continuing the discrimination, the exclusion, and the attack on those who are raising these questions. 
after decades of fighting apartheid, is the African National Congress now guilty of implementing its own brand of discrimination, this time based on class and wealth? Millions of black South Africans still live in shacks, and many are left homeless because of forced evictions by the government. In many ways, it's a somber reminder of life under apartheid when black people were removed from their homes. See, they say the apartheid era is over. Yes, we agree the apartheid is over, but there's a new apartheid system that is operating in South Africa, and that apartheid is between the rich and the poor. Every day that we have to resist these kind of, of evictions, uh, it's even worse than what the um, apartheid government will do. I mean, it was clear that uh, it was under that system, but it is now the very same uh, brothers and sisters, the very same leaders who we have once um, had confidence. used to be different, Stephen. Nothing to worry about back then except making myself dizzy on the old seahorse ride at Funland.
This seahorse used to make me so happy. Now it's just giving me whiplash. I feel like there's just no point to it. You know what I mean? I just feel tingly. <sighs> You'll understand when you have a job. I do have a job. I protect humanity from magic and monsters and stuff. I mean a real job that you get paid for. I'm paid in the smiles across the town's faces. I don't see anyone smiling. You pick up a job to buy a house, or raise kids, or to impress your dad. You work away your life, and what does it get you? Smiles and faces? No. You get cash. Cash that can't buy back what the job takes. Not if you rode every seahorse in the world. Huh. <sighs> Whoa.